Okay, in today's video, I am going to go over how to determine the equivalent capacitance for capacitors in parallel. Okay, this is the circuit we're going to use. You can see we have three capacitors in parallel, and of course, you can apply this rule to any number of capacitors in parallel, whether you have one, two, three, four, five, or many more. All we're going to do is we're going to figure out the equivalent capacitance, and you can see we have a 12-volt battery, which we're not going to use in this video. And we have one capacitor, which is a 12-farad capacitor, another a 6, and another a 5-farad capacitors. Okay? And the rule for adding them up and for figuring out the equivalent capacitance is pretty straightforward. All you have to do is add them up. The equivalent capacitance or the total capacitance is simply C1 plus C2 plus the capacitance of capacitor number 3 and so on and so on if you had more. You can kind of see that these plates are all parallel to each other. It's kind of like one big plate. You can see these plates are all parallel to each other. It's kind of like one big plate. And the capacitance is directly proportional to the area of the plates. So as the area of the plates goes up, the capacitance goes up. And you can see these plates are all connected to each other, so to speak. And on the bottom, all the plates are connected to each other. So it's kind of like they're acting like one big plate on the bottom and one big plate on the top. So the way that it works is you just add up the capacitance. And if you add up to get the equivalent capacitance, you get 12 plus 6 farads plus 5 farads. And therefore, you get that the equivalent capacitance of this circuit is 23 farads. You just add up the capacitance of each of the capacitors. That's all there is to it. That is equivalent capacitance for capacitors in parallel. OK, thanks for watching. I hope that was helpful. If you thought that was helpful, give me a thumbs up or a comment in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.